hello. I love making an altar video for you guys, but I hate the part where the lighting is just the worst in the whole world. There's just junk in the background. <laughs> but this is my summer altar. If you didn't see that video, it's I'll just put it in the the thingies in the corner. Um so it is no longer summer and I want to set up a fresh fall altar. This is covered in dirt because this plant right here, this one, likes to jump off the shelf because it's top heavy right now. I'm working on it. <laughs> so there's dirt everywhere. Ah! And I'm just dropping giant glass cubes. So first I'm just going to take everything off the altar and I didn't bring over a new altar cloth. All I have is a small one. So I'm going to need something for this. Mm, my creepy cloth. I have to... I brought over a little box of things, but it's... I'm realizing I forgot some important stuff, so I'll be right back. Alright, hopefully the lighting works and you can see what I'm doing here. Okay, <laughs> now uh, now you can see it is empty. I've grabbed a piece of cloth from my art room that is this sheer gray stuff. So I thought that might be fun and spooky. So I'm just gonna layer that on top of here. I like to have a little bit of an overlay on the front because I have storage under here. <laughs> And it's not the most aesthetically pleasing. I need to get like some nice bins. Um, I also have this creepy cloth. Like, I cannot tell what you can see, but I have creepy cloth. It's black. Um, and I'm going to put it over top of the sheer material. Because I'm here for some spooks. Some spooky decor. Let's get that. Eh, the sheer stuff wants to fall off because it's so slippery. Okay. There we go. Spooky. Spooky spook. Spooky spooky spook. Okay. And then I also have this lovely sparkly orange tinsel piece that I'm going to put on the back here because sparkles and it's got fall leaves and stuff in it so cute um and then i want i've got as usual some little pot trays um because you saw this is a wire shelf i can't set things like my cauldron on there without putting it on something so i'm just gonna put it on this little dude so i can have my cauldron out yes and then I'm going to take what's in this out and take a second one that I'm going to fill with um, little nature-y bits that I have. I have like some acorns, this like hazelnut shell thing, a little seed, acorn bits, and just fill that up. And then I have like this seed guy. I'm going to put that with that. Yeah, some nature -y bits, and I'm gonna get out this pine cone. This is a big old pine cone. Um, yeah. Uh, and I have, I also have this little tiny altar cloth that's brown with leaves and stuff. It's very cute. So I might put that somewhere. Maybe I'll leave it like kind of folded so it's small. I've got nature -y stuff right there, so maybe I'll layer this underneath there. Fun, fun. Um, I have another piece of tinsel, so I'll just put that in the, the little dish of nature -y bits. Fun, 
Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> and I want my crystal ball. I'm going to put that with the cauldron. Fun fact about my crystal ball. It is just a giant marble um, that I put inside a little bottle cap. <laughs> there we go. It's fun. It's really beautiful. And yeah. So then I'm going to put out some little jars of crystals. I have some citrine and onyx because they're the right colors and they've been sitting on my other altar so why not bring them out here? I'm sure they'll be happy. So I'm just gonna set them up. You know, cute and crystal-y and make me happy. And then I have a big old chunk of obsidian which I always like to have some obsidian on my altar. So I'm gonna put that guy up here. Let me put you over here. Nice shimmer in the back. Um, some regular crystal quartz. I'll put with that guy. I don't know why I don't have a ton of stuff for this. Ooh, I have these are pine needles from a tree that was in the backyard of the house that I grew up in. So I'm gonna put those with this nature stuff over here. Yeah. And I have to find somewhere to put Ganesha. Maybe I should get my big one. My big, my big, big Ganesha. This is my big Ganesha. There we go. We'll put him in the middle right there. Aw, he looks so lovely. Oh my gosh. And then I have this little um, pillow thing that is my friend Malsha knit for me and put herbs and stuff inside it. I think it's dusty right now. Mm, but it still smells good. <laughs> so I'm going to put that with Ganesh right there. A little pillow for him. And this is the offering dish that I got for him. So I just like to put that there. And let's see. I have all of the summer stuff sitting out. I'm going to put this little tiny ohm on there. Because they're so cute and fun and ohm. Yeah, you know. You know how it is. Um, and then I have this box from Malsha that has all kinds of handwritten notes and stuff, so I'm going to see if there's like a, a quote or something, or a joke. Oh my god. <laughs> Malsha, every time I open this I see something new. Oh my god! <laughs> Malsha! <laughs> Oh yeah, okay, this one says keep calm, which is our back, because it's the witchy season, so I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put that out there, and then I have this one, let's put little cute things on it, this little black tag from Malsha also, I'm gonna put that in there, it's a tiny pentacle, and it has adhesive on the back, so it's just gonna stick there, <laughs> let's see, is there anything under here? We have flower pots, stuff, stuff and things. I'm gonna put the little ring. Ah, that little guy. I'm gonna put that on there. I like to have happy little trinkets and stuff on in here. Um, I think I'm gonna put the live by inspiring others also back on here because it's so lovely. I also have this tiny little um, ornament that I got in elementary school for Halloween. So maybe I'll nestle that in, or I'll like put it with the. I'll put it with that funny quote. You'll see it in a minute. I gathered a couple more things, um, including I took a trip to the art room and remembered that I thrifted these tiny little soft fuzzy bears. Uh, I got a jar of them, so I have a couple to give to my mom and my sister, too, because we have some other ones that we got together, so I'm like, uh, spooky ones for the three of us to have all matching ones, yes. Uh, I like having cute little matching things with my mom and sister, so we have, like, we have these little pumpkins that lines by the door. It says, welcome muggles, and we have these little bears, 
and yeah, so I'm gonna add these bears to the other bears that we have. <laughs> I'm gonna put these on the altar because they're so precious. Oh my gosh. So we're gonna have little bears. Little bears. And got another acorn top. I'm gonna put that in. The acorny stuff. And this little rock of some sort. I don't know what it is. This circle of wood and this pentacle thing that Sherman gave me. Uh, put that right, right there. Yeah, that was crystal pendulum. I'll put that on here. Uh, put out some crystals for good measure. Just some more quartz crystals, they're really cleansing and nice. And this little doo-doo doo again. Put that out. Ooh, this is pleasing. <laughs> and maybe a little seashell of some sort for some good measure. Cause sneeze shells. Mm, they're great. So for now I think that's gonna be my altar. I will now show you where you can actually see it. Ooh, I'm gonna put put this guy on here. Okay. <laughs> so this is kind of an overview. Yeah. So I've got some little t tokens and stuff, and the little message from Malsha. And we've got the crystals and the amber and this beautiful. Color. Ganesh, little friends, and this little shiny bugger down there. Wow, and the little bears. And you can see, woo, the spookies, the spookies, they're so spooky. And then I have all these things that I hang up here, Celtic knot, this is the flower of life, and the tree of life. The silhouette of the tree of life. <laughs> Pick up. Look at how beautiful it is outside, look at that. Do you see that fall color? We're getting some fall colors. Also, my spider plant is making a baby. <laughs> See? Here it comes. Yeah, that's my lovely porch. And my friend's lighter. Cool. <laughs> this happened with my camera. It told me something went wrong. <sighs> okay. Well, that is my altar. These are my plant babies. Um, I hope you enjoy this little video. I'm having some issues with my computer, of course. So I can't do a lot at the moment. I'm trying to back up everything in case it dies. Crossing fingers that my computer is not on its way to death because I like my computer. And also computers are expensive. <laughs> So, hopefully I can get that all situated and edit this video. But I have still have more exciting plans coming soon. I just have to get everything organized and my computer. So, now we can officially start the spooky season because I've got the altar set up and the ferret cage is also set up. So I'll insert some clips from that at the end here. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Blessed be, and have a nice fall. Hi.
Do I need to move the pumpkin? Or you, you can do it. Can you do it? Yo, the bottom floor is not done yet. You can do it, you can do it. She but Wow, that's some excitement. Wow, no escaping, no escaping. What are you doing? 